Alright, this is video number three in the series and this is showing you how to use the main packet tracer interface. So the first thing we're going to do is we're going to locate the icon for our packet tracer on the desktop, double click on it and that should launch the program. And when it launches it will be set at a certain size so you can just click maximize just to give yourself the full screen. Now this area here is known as the workspace. This is the main area that we'll be using to drag and drop devices out to and then connect them together using the connection tool. Down along the bottom we have the different device categories such as routers, end devices, security, connections, switches. The main devices we'll be using for our exercises this semester are end devices, switches and connections. Okay, so let's have a look at some of the tools we use. The main tool you'll be using will be the select tool. So this is the kind of the go-to or the default tool. So if I have a device and I'm just going to click and click again to bring a device out. And I will do the same for end devices. And uh, don't worry, I will show you how to do these and which ones we need to use later on. Okay, and using the select tool, I can either select a single device or I can select drag and select multiple devices at the same time. The next tool on the interface is the note tool. So if I click on that and then click anywhere on the workspace, I can put in a note. This is a note. And then just click back on the select tool. So you just need to get used to clicking on this, going back to the select tool just so you don't stay on the particular other tools because some of them can be kind of dangerous, which I'll show you now. Okay, and then if I want to make changes to that note, I can just click on it and then make a change. And then go back to select tool to come off it. Okay, so the next tool we have in the interface is the delete tool. So clicking on this, I can then click on any item on the desktop, which will delete that item from the desktop. Alright, so it's quite a powerful tool and quite dangerous. So you need to get used to when you're finishing with the tool clicking on the select tool again to come off it otherwise you can delete something you don't mean to delete and then along the top of the interface the other things we may need the undo tool so to undo our last action or redo I'll just undo that again and then the zoom controls now these will really only be used for large networks which we won't be working with yet but you can zoom in on a network zoom out from a network or even click the one in the middle which will reset the zoom to default levels okay so that's our first video on uh, using the packet tracer interface and in the next video I'll show you how to select the end devices and the devices that we'll be using for building networks